What do you think I should do? Oh, yes. A vision of a greener future in the heart of the capital. For the Prime Minister, the London Wetland Centre shows what can be done when nature's given a helping hand. In a 25-year plan, the government commits to a cleaner, more pleasant environment where wildlife can thrive. <laughs> Launching the strategy, she said plastic is a priority and gave a commitment to eliminating avoidable waste by 2042. We will encourage manufacturers to take responsibility for the impacts of their products and rationalise the number of different types of plastic they use. As it is consumed, we will drive down the amount of plastic in circulation through reducing demand. Supermarkets also need to do much more to cut down on unnecessary plastic package packaging. So we will work with them to explore introducing plastic-free aisles where all the food is sold loose. But supermarkets insist consumers want hygienic and convenient packaging. For now, plastic is the best material they've got. The government's challenge is changing their mindset and ours. You don't actually want to use more packaging than you need to use because it costs you money. Uh, and actually, ideally, we'll find ways to, to have different alternative packaging solutions which are more, more you know, environmentally friendly uh, and actually cheaper and better for the customer and the environment. It's almost all packaging. This is single-use plastic. The plastic debris that lines the River Thames shows just how urgently action is needed. Campaigners clean up 200 tonnes of it a year and they say legislation is needed to stem the flow. We now need to tackle plastic bottles and we need to tackle the food-related packaging that we're seeing in the river uh, much more robustly. And we're all willing to get behind this now, but we need the systems in place, the organisation in place to enable that to happen and vague promises as to what we're going to achieve in 25 years' time, it's not enough. For almost a year now, Sky Ocean Rescue has been campaigning for a reduction in single-use plastics. All the feedback shows that people are alarmed by just how much packaging is floating out to sea. The danger for the government is that voters will see the lack of action in the environment plan as a missed opportunity to deal with the plastic problem. Polling by a Conservative think tank suggested the Tories need strong environmental policies to woo younger voters. So has it worked? Not a big deciding thing for me in terms of voting is more the uh, economy and stuff like that and investment in public services. No, I don't agree with the policies in other areas. If they couldn't produce results, it would be like to make me vote for them because you get the feeling that there's a lot of talk at the minute. This is now a government that wants to be seen as green, but it still has much to prove. Thomas Moore, Sky News.